it was uh, very difficult to convince people to go ahead and take vaccines. A lot of people are worried about the after effects of taking the vaccines or even COVID itself. What has it done to us? There is no evidence that COVID-19 vaccines work differently in people of different ethnicities. Conspiracy people, mm -hmm. there's a government saying stuff, there's people giving their opinions, mm -hmm. uh, then there's the religious aspect. Mm -hmm. And it was all about, especially for black people, it's like, do we trust? Who do, do we, we trust? Who do we trust, yeah. yeah. I do understand vaccine hesitancy and the feeling that people have that they don't necessarily want to take a new medicine. Nobody wants to take medicines anyway. We had a mixture of people who had a massive amount of misinformation, real information, and also seeing the experience of their colleagues or friends or family who were at the front line and just realizing the difference in terms of the equal opportunity or the impact that it was having in the community in real time. They were coerced to walk mm -hmm. because they need to feed their family. The most impact that I had with COVID was kind of the way that it affected my schooling life and my, you know, my mental health. So for me, I was like, this is the beast. If you get it, you are denying Christ and everything. This is what some people believe in. Everything we're doing is to try and prevent disease from COVID and harm because we've seen too many people die. These aren't just numbers, these are real people and real people who are remaining unprotected.